What's going on, guys? For everyone, Ghost here coming back at you with a brand new Dokkan Battle video. Yes, it's been a while since I've uploaded a Dokkan Battle video. Yes, it's been a minute. And I know that I've been uploading a lot of One Piece videos, and I've been enjoying One Piece, but uh, I figured this time I'd try and upload a video for Dokkan. And yes, I haven't been uploading a lot of content in my channel recently, and I apologize for that. I've gotten lazy, and I shouldn't have gotten lazy, but Ghost just didn't really have any motivation to make content. I felt like a lot of that content... For me, again, I, I don't want to make any excuses. It sounds dumb. And I don't want to make, you know, this video just me explaining over and over why I, I just haven't been really making content. So I'm going to just say this. I'm not going to do the lazy game anymore. I'm going to try to make content. I'm going to try to make as much of it as possible, including with more Dokkan, more One Piece, uh, and anything else I can think of. Any more anime reviews. I've been promising anime reviews, and I've done a few. Uh, I'm going to do some more soon. And hopefully everyone enjoys them. Uh, I definitely am looking forward to creating as much content as possible. I love making content. I do enjoy it. Uh, and it is a passion. I do uh, <clears throat> strive to do as much as I can. But for Dokkan, the World Tournament is out. I'm pretty sure everyone already knows that. And there's a lot of cool uh, stuff to get from the World Tournament. Including if you hit first, you can get the sisters, Kaylee and Khalifa. And of course, uh, Gawasu is in the Guaranteed SSR banner. That if you get the tickets, you can get him, of course, and some other units that I'm pretty sure if anyone needs or wants or don't need or I don't know. If you need them or don't, they're there as well. Uh, including some, the EZA for our good friend here, Omega Shinron. And, of course, the update for the game, which is the 4.8.4. Now, I'm going to tell you something. I've been waiting for this update for a little while, and I'm happy that it's out because I didn't have this account here linked. any, uh, But I do now. I, I do now. The reason for that is I just didn't have a Facebook at the time, and I did have it secure to the point that I didn't think anyone would try to steal the account because it's kind of dumb. But uh, I have it secured now. It'll never go away. So I'm happy. <laughs> and the biggest thing everyone's been asking me about is this. This video that's coming out today, uh, later in the afternoon, maybe even at night. I'm, I'm pretty sure it's coming out at night. Um, the Dokkan Volume 2 video, which is coming out, I'm pretty sure it's going to be more or less for us. Maybe for JP as well. I don't know. But I'm pretty sure it's going to bring out the explanation of this Bardock free-to-play that's coming out for both sides for Saiyan Day. It's what I'm thinking it's going down to be. I think that they're going to explain to us what the character is going to look like or what it's going to be able to do. And I'm pretty sure it's going to discuss a lot of those characters that we're going to get, including the free-to-play team. It's kind of like the Frieza's, Frieza Force, uh, but for Saiyans, really. It's just with all the Saiyans, Fasha, um, I forget all their names, uh, Shugesh. R Bardock, um, I forget, I forget the rest. Point is, that's exactly what that is. It's a free-to-play team that obviously seems to be looking very cool, very good, and I definitely think that it's a team worth getting, obviously. Um, and maybe we might even get an exclusive character for Global again, like we did last time in Christmas when we got the blue KO Ken Goku, uh, and we got hit back in the banner as well with a couple of cool characters in there as well. Now, again, maybe it may not be the case. Maybe we may not get that. We might just get the uh, explanation for Bardock, what his category is going to be. I'm pretty sure it's already been out there, what his category is going to be and all that stuff. I'm pretty sure they've already explained that. And I, I may, have, may, may have missed me over my head and I may have not seen it. But point being, never not be too... How do I say this? Never be too... Uh, Let's not, let's not, I can't even speak English today, guys. That's how crazy this is. What I'm trying to say is, let's not hope for something we're not expecting. And that being, maybe we might get what we were expecting or maybe not. So let's not get our hopes up. But for right now, let's just see what this is about. I'm pretty sure what I mentioned before is that it's going to explain the free-to-play characters. They might just be talking about when they're going to come out and including some new events and do some new progress for global, all that good stuff. Uh, but if they do release something exclusive, what would you want it to be if it were to be a new LR or maybe a new category leader that you want? Let me know in the comments below what it is that you're expecting it to be. And if it's something that's reasonable, go ahead and leave it in the in the comments below. For me, I I honestly, honest to God, I would love if if this were even possible. I definitely would love to see an LR Kid Boo. I, I think it's about time that he gets his LR. Um, that would be pretty awesome. I know that we're too far apart for that. So if anything, I would rather get an LR Kid, not Kid, an LR Buhan, really, where 
he is fighting against Mystic Gohan. That would be really awesome to see another Mystic Gohan, uh, like a featured unit with the LR Dokkan Fest unit, or maybe even just make them both like le like Dragon Ball, uh, like a legendary banner for him, and then a Dokkan Fest unit for uh, Gohan. That would be pretty awesome. I would I would love that. That'd be pretty awesome. But getting two characters, that'd be a little wild. But again. I would love to see an LR Buhan. I think it's about time that he gets his LR, like I said, or even LR Kid Buu. Uh, that'd be awesome, too. Uh, one or the other, that's what I hope for, exactly. Um, I don't know what their categories would be, but I, I definitely think uh, Majin Buu Saga would be in there. Uh, I don't know. Maybe the second one could be Pure Evil category. That'd be pretty sweet. That'd be a pretty awesome category to have, just Pure Evil. And that's a pretty good category to have them in because there's a lot of pure evil characters in the, in the Dokkan battle game. And of course, there's already categories that probably would, would work already with that, but are like movie bosses. But not everyone's a movie boss, so that, that kind of doesn't make any sense either. Um, but I'm pretty sure there's a category for it, but I would love to see a boo like that. That would be pretty sick. Uh, again, if you think that that's not a, ca a character that would be worthy, then I don't know what is. That's a great character. Um, or maybe even a Dokkan Fest unit. Maybe uh, a new Mystic Gohan. That'd be pretty awesome. Or um, maybe, I don't know, there's a lot of characters and I don't want to ramble all day about it. So I, I would I would definitely stick to what I said. Um, a new Gohan would be pretty awesome. A new uh, Dokkan Fest Gohan, I'd be pretty sick. Uh, or even a, a LR Buhan or, or Kid Buu, that'd be pretty awesome. Uh, but I don't know, expect the unexpected. That's that's something to to kind of look into as well. But anyway, let me know in the comments below what you think this is all this is gonna be, or is it gonna include an exclusive unit, or is this gonna talk about what I just mentioned before, which is the new LR Bardock that's gonna have everyone with him, and including that the uh, free to play characters that are gonna come with them. So for saying day. So anyway, hopefully everyone's having a fantastic weekend. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video, and if you guys did, slap a like on it. Make sure to subscribe to the YouTube channel. I will keep you guys updated on new content every other week because I'm gonna try to keep my videos short and sweet to the point. So anyway, guys, stay awesome. Keep playing Dokkan, and I will see you next time.